Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to say your real-time location using Google Maps in iMessage on your iPhone or iPad. Thanks to a recent update, Google Maps can now let you say your real-time location via iMessage on your iOS or iPad OS device. So just in case you are fond of Google Maps and wish to give this all new feature a try, this video is for you. That all being said, let's get going before getting started make sure you have subscribed our youtube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 reader first and foremost make sure you have updated google maps on your iphone or ipad because this all new feature works only in the latest version of google maps if you haven't done it as yet open app store and then tap on your profile located at the top right now scroll down and then find google maps and then hit update right next to google maps to update the app besides also make sure that google maps has access to your location to get it then open the settings app then scroll down and then select privacy after that tap on location services and then find google maps and then allow it to access your location it's worth pointing out that for a smooth functioning location sharing experience i would also recommend you to allow google maps to access your precise location once you have allowed google maps to access your location open the messages app and then head into a conversation where you want to share your real-time location next up you have to find google maps in the iMessage app drawer and then you have to hit share your real-time location for one hour widget then you can write an optional message and finally hit send to say your real-time location that's pretty much it so that's the way you can say your real-time location using google maps via iMessage on your iphone or ipad of course if you ever want to stop sharing your location simply return to the same conversation and then hit stop to stop sharing your location if you have found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone and iPad hacks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.